Myth, volcanic ash melts jet engines instantly. Truth, the danger is not heat alone. It is how ash turns to glass inside the turbines, blocking the system from within. The popular image is simple. Volcanic ash hits the engine and the fiery heat just melts it like wax. But that is not what really happens. Jet engines are designed to withstand enormous heat, far hotter than volcanic ash on its own. The real problem is chemistry. Volcanic ash is made of fine, abrasive minerals. When sucked into an engine, those particles hit the hot turbine and fuse into molten glass. That glass then coats and clogs the cooling holes built into the blades. With those holes blocked, the blades cannot cool properly. Airflow is disrupted, temperatures spike and the engine can flame out. It is not instant destruction, it is a suffocating build-up that chokes the system. That is why aircraft do not fly through volcanic ash at all. Crews are trained to avoid it completely because no filter or shield can stop that microscopic dust from crippling the engine once it hits the turbines. So no, volcanic ash does not melt engines on contact. It fuses, clogs and chokes them from the inside, proving why avoidance is the only real protection. Now here is the question, does knowing ash turns to glass inside engines make you more impressed by the engineering or more uneasy about how fragile flight can be?